2017 Detroit Motor Show, are star cars. Auto car staffers picked their favorite arrivals from this year's show, which welcomed everything from driverless concepts to production sports cars. After two days in the freezing climates of Detroit, auto car staffers are now headed back to Blighty. Seven members of the team have nominated their favorite new model from this year's show, their explanations can be found underneath in no particular order. Which Detroit Motor Show car is your favorite? Let us know in the comments below. Rachel Burgess Infiniti QX50 Infiniti models have never rocked my boat particularly but this is a good looking car in a fast growing segment. Not only that, it has some genuinely innovative technology in the new VCT engine, a variable compression 2.0 liter petrol engine which claims to have V6 performance with diesel fuel economy. Here's hoping. Jimmy Beckwith, GAC in spirit. GAC's cars were easily lost in this year's show of hard hitters, but the interior of the Inspirit concept stood out. Its fresh, crisp cabin is a classy yet distinctive take on the interior of the future, even if on the outside it's the electric SUV coupe we've seen time and again. The centrally mounted bonsai tree is a little absurd, but adds abundant charm. Matt Burt Lexus LS the Japanese manufacturer is enjoying a new lease of life, inspired by the launch of its best driver's car yet, the LC. The LS uses the same underpinnings, which bodes well. There's a confidence about these products which I admire. Mark Tishaw Mercedes AMG GTC Coupe I still can't quite get my head around the Mercedes AMG GT lineup, but with each new model, I like what I see more. The GTC is more rapid than the base cars but isn't as hard as the Madcap GTR model, think of it as the Porsche 911 GTS to the GT3. Which makes it a very appealing road car indeed, and one of the best looking ones out there at that. Andrew Frankel Audi Q8 At last, an Audi that departs from the once great but now time-worn design language to which Audi has clung too long. In its flanks lie the style of the next A8, A7, and A6, all due before the end of next year. Switch-free interior is genuinely stunning too. Greg Cable ID Buzz The more things change the more they stay the same. Combining the iconic styling treatment and inherent versatility of its original microbus with the high solutions and zero-emission compatibility of its new modular electric platform structure, the Volkswagen ID. Buzz proves self-driving electric cars can be every bit as characterful as they are clever. It's a winner in concept car guys. Let's hope Volkswagen follows through with a production version. Mike Duff Kia Stinger In a show lacking much in the way of new metal, the Kia Stinger was the standout for me. It's handsome, spacious, and the V6-powered GT looks set to be a performance bargain, not phased by its lack of a premium batch. What's not to like about a 360 BHP rear driver with a 7-year warranty? Sam Sheehan, Rins Pete Oasis The Oasis is my choice, because I, like you, enjoy driving, but commuting to work through morning rush hour is one of my least favorite activities. Riding to work in an autonomous model that focuses on keeping its occupants calm, like the Rins Pete Oasis, would reduce average stress levels, improve quality of life, and, most importantly, make those weekend drives in a sports car even more precious.